Alright, the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to learn how to use a disk manager. Um, they have a cartridge version of disk manager, but we're going to be using a uh, disk version. So, I don't know if you can see this, but this is a cartridge of TI Extended Basic. This is what you're going to need to run this particular disk manager. That just slides right in the slot. Screen will reset itself. Okay. Now it's asking us whether we want to use extended basic or regular basic. The first thing we're going to do is take our diskette. Okay? This diskette says Disk Manager 1000. So we're going to use Disk Manager 1000. So what we're going to do is go to our peripheral expansion box, open up the door, slide our disk in right there. Okay. Now this is a, a TI Extended Basic Auto Load Disk, so as soon as we hit Extended Basic, it's going to begin the loading process. It takes a second, and then it pops up. Okay. We want to use Disk Manager A. So now it's loading Disk Manager. Okay, it takes a second and the screen changes color. All right, select option. We're going to do disk utilities too. First thing we're going to do is we are going to catalog a disk. Okay, so what this means is let's say you have an old floppy that you found that you don't know what's on it. Okay, what this is going to do is it's going to catalog it for you. So what we're going to do is pull out our disk, pull out the disk manager disk as the information is already loaded, and then we find a disk that we don't know what's on it, quote unquote. Let's say we don't know what's on this disk. Okay, it's just a random disk that we found in a box. Slide the random disk inside. Okay. Option one, catalog. So let's see what's on this puppy. And it's asking us which drive we want to use. And I only have one drive, so we're going to use drive one. And there it goes. It catalogs it for me. I have three characters on this. Uh, these are characters that I am building for a video game I'm making for the TI-99. It gives you the size, the name, so on and so forth. You can write this down and keep it with your disk so that you never forget what's on it. So that is pretty much how you use the catalog function of the Disk Manager 1000.